Masks are back at Bucknell University after the CDC classified Union County's COVID transmission level as high. Newswatch 16's Nikki Cry spoke to students about putting the masks back on. Masking has been a hot topic since the start of the COVID-19 pandemic. Two and a half years later, many places no longer require face coverings, but students at Bucknell University in Lewisburg are wearing them once again. This is our senior year. Why would we want that? We want to know each other and we've been around each other for three or four or five weeks now. What's the difference? Bucknell University's COVID-19 policy states that masks are required indoors when transmission rates are classified as high in Union County. The CDC declared that rating on Monday and students were notified that masks are back immediately until further notice. I do appreciate the fact that Bucknell is COVID conscious and that they are worried about not just the student safety, but the professor's safety and the entire town of Lewisburg safety. Many students don't agree with that. I'm not a fan of masks. I don't like masks one bit. No. No, they, they make my ears itchy, my nose, my nose starts running in them, sneeze them all. I don't like them. Kind of annoying, especially with like glasses, they start like fogging up. And, you know, we had like a good thing going for like first couple months with no masks, but kind of sucks at the back. Lucille Ketterer studied outside because of the mask mandate. Luckily, they have a lot of outdoor pavilions now with like chargers for your laptop and everything so that you don't have to work inside because why would anyone want to? But others don't mind wearing a mask on campus. If what I have to do is to wear a mask to, during class to have a normal like college experience, then I'm okay with it. A representative for Bucknell University says when Union County's risk level goes back to medium or low, the mask mandate will be over. Nikki Cries, Newswatch 16, Union County.